Warner Brothers pleaded guilty yesterday to insider trading charges related to Donald Trump's media company stock. The pair admitted to illegally making over $22 million before the public announcement in 2021 that Donald Trump's media company was going public. The men had been tipped off that Digital World Acquisition Corp planned to merge with Trump Media and Technology, whose main asset is the social media network Truth Social. We want to note this indictment did not implicate the former president or his company. For more on all this case, I want to bring in fe uh, federal trial attorney Robin Nunn. Robin, what knowledge did the brothers have that made this insider trading? Where did they cross that line? Yeah, it turns out the Southern District of, Prosec of, of New York prosecutors had a lot of information um, about these individuals. Um, the brothers had learned about the information from a business associate, someone that they worked with, who they had placed on the board of one of the companies, and they had used that information to essentially buy up a lot of, of stock based on this non-public material information that they had gained from the business associate who was on the board um, of the company. And so what type of punishment do they face now? And what happens to the $22 million that they reportedly made? Well, insider trading, um, you know, carries a, a pretty hefty prison sentence. Um, they have reached a plea agreement in this case, which means that the prosecutors are recommending three to four years for one of the brothers and four to five years for one of the other brothers, but the judge doesn't have to listen to those recommendations and can um, order that they be placed in prison for up to 20 years um, in this case. They have also agreed to return the money um, that they gain by trading on this non-public information, which, you know, totals in the upwards range of $8 million for one brother and, and almost $4 million for the other. All right. Robin Nunn, thank you. Thank you.